Hello, I'm Drawing Pin and welcome to Let's Plays of Motorsport Manager, of course, for International GT Championship with Pinwheel Racing. And in the last episode, we were in uh, China, yeah, Beijing, and we had a really good result, especially with Lara. She managed to get a fastest lap. Uh, qualifying wasn't great, but uh, at the same time, uh, I don't think that hurt us too much. And then Deville managed to uh, just miss out on a podium, but uh, we did put her on a two stop and she just pushed that uh, soft, super soft tire really hard. And uh, it worked out well, actually. I thought it was better than it was. I didn't think it was going to work out, but it uh, worked out okay. Uh, she might have been able to get to third, but uh, she just missed out. The tyres were just going off at the end. I kind of pushed them a bit too much. But uh, Lara just comfortably won that, no problem. She was well ahead. And so we've uh, closed the gap to Kuchevic and uh, widened the gap here to Hammer. So we're just at that halfway point now. There's seven races to go. So, you know, still all to play for. There's... Uh, we're not we're not out of the woods of this yet by a long shot you know 22 point gap is nothing so uh you know we've got to keep going but uh we've got uh, quite a few other parts and now done the uh, engines and gearboxes and we're just waiting on like the suspension and brakes but uh, you know they'll uh, they'll build pretty quickly uh so i think one of them is actually done let's come over here and just have a look i think the set of brakes is finished right where are we yeah the brakes is finished so we should be able to use those um, and we'll go and build another set in a minute. Let's just take this interview. Uh, Lauren, I to apologize to representative. Uh, soaked with champagne. Well, if you're standing on the podium, you're going to get soaked. I don't care, Richard Price. That's the that's the issue. If you're standing on the podium and someone's spraying champagne around, you expect to get wet. So, uh, you know, uh, no apologies necessary, Lara. You enjoy it. Ooh, oh my God. Hello. I think we got to hire you. Uh, we're going to say no to you. And we're going to say no to you, and no to you, and oh, uh, oh, you are good, but damn, you suck. So, nope, you're going. Right, let's swap some more people out now. Uh, I don't think I knew, did I renew the contracts? I'm not sure if I did. I think I meant to, but I don't think I actually did in the end. Uh, so, tires and fixing. Yeah, we didn't renew the contracts. Yeah, okay, we'll do that in a second. Uh, let's go and swap. You let's get a front jack man. We'll get a rear jack. I mean, to be honest, I don't know why I'm doing this because uh, you know they have mistakes anyway. Uh, regardless of whether they're fresh or not, you know it's just a random number generator. So uh, you can't always uh, beat those RNG gods, unfortunately. Um, tires and refuel. Tires and refuel as well. Go to you. It's everyone fresh. Uh, let's hire this guy in because I mean, we can't really pass that up. That's just awesome, isn't it? I think we just kind of got to go with that. That's so freaking good. Um, uh, I was about to say we should sack you, but you're really good on the rear jack, so... Hmm. You kind of do everything. I guess you are probably someone we should get rid of. You have made a mistake. Yeah, let's get rid of you. Goodbye, you're gone. Right, I think what I'm going to do... Let's just quickly come over here, actually. I'll sort out the car, and then I'll go back and renew the contracts and actually do that this time. Uh, the, oh, boy, yeah. That is an issue, because if we get there, then we've got another, we could take a risky part, but yeah, I'm not sure that's worth it. I think we're just going to go with that, we'll go with that, and we'll just kind of gamble on a decent component. You know, just we'll just live it up to the RNG gods, and hopefully we get something good, because, yeah, there's not really a lot there that's any good. I mean, we could always chuck a, a legal set down for... Uh, for next season i'm not sure if we're going to need that but um you know i think we might just plan for that so uh you know we'll stop building up some parts for next season but uh let's get this last set of brakes down it's going to be done eight days before the race so we'll be able to uh bang out like start working on the suspension or something next uh yeah probably like suspension or the rear wing's pretty terrible i'd say suspension is probably a bit more important than the rear wing so i think we'll do that so all right i'll wait for the car repair i'm just going to come over here and i'll do this but i'll see you over at the car repair i'm just going to renew everyone's contract okay so here we go the car repair's finished i've done all the uh contracts for the uh oh man look at that we've done the engine as well really okay i've done all the pit crew as uh well that's what i meant to say before i got distracted there so uh let's get that up to speed so we're probably almost i mean to be honest lara could probably use those brakes now to be honest uh, but we may as well strip some more weight out of them and uh, wait for those other ones to be built which are going to be like six to eight nine days so those will probably be done they might be done yeah they're probably going to be done just before those brakes are finished 
uh, built and then we can probably get that other set and we might be able to use both sets of brakes for the race that's kind of my hope anyway and uh, meanwhile we'll work a little passive tick on these guys and get those up to speed and uh, yeah we'll have it we'll probably have a backlog of uh, parts but that's always the way because uh, these suspensions and brakes and stuff don't take that long to build once you get the engines and gearboxes out of the way the rest of the stuff doesn't take that long to build so uh, you know a couple of races time we'll probably have everything up to speed and then just work on the performance of everything and i'll say i might lay some parts down for next season as well just in case we never know uh, it's halfway point so uh, we're by no means guaranteed to could win this one so i think we'll probably chuck a few parts down illegal parts and get ready for next season just in case so uh, anyway let's move it on and we'll get to where those uh, brakes are finished i think Right, so here we go. I've got this from Ernie, and it's choosing a vote. I don't think I want to choose a vote. We've got the very high merit payments in. The points are okay as they are. don't overly like the qualifying, to be honest. I could probably do with getting rid of that, but... Um, apart from that, I don't think... Maybe the pole position, but I think that's already been voted on, so I don't think we can actually vote on... Uh, vote on that this season so let's just kind of remove fastest lap which sometimes we get i mean we got that in the last one uh, remove double points i mean i guess that could be good but it's not really going to help us this year and next year yeah you know it might help us to dry dry tire compounds could have some extra tire choices i guess so we only got like cause it 12 so we're gonna have 15 that might help us out a bit um but we do really good on our tire wear anyway yeah, so I don't think uh, promotion bonus not really much of an issue there. Last page bonus, no. Don't want to get rid of the hybrid mode. Definitely don't want to get weight stripping. What's upcoming votes actually? Spec gearbox, no, and simultaneous gearbox, uh, simultaneous pit stops. I'd say no to both of those. Um, definitely no spec gearbox. Yeah, I'm gonna leave it. I don't. I don't think I'm gonna do anything. I don't overly like the qualifying, but that's about it. Um, so, yeah, I, I think I'm just going to leave it and do that. So, yeah. So, uh, let's keep going because we're still a few days away from uh, those brakes being built. So, uh, let's just keep going. Okay, so here we go. The brakes are finished. And, yeah, of course, we got uh, diesel at plus uh, 50 on uh, softs, supers, and ultras, of course. Because that's generally what I get. I don't overly like that uh, random component because that's just generally seems to what I get. So... But, you know, it, it, it's a bonus, so it's something, I guess. But, uh, yeah, it's not brilliant. Um, I'm kind of tempted to just leave that because that's going to take... Yeah, it's going to take quite a long time. I'm tempted to just leave that uh, just to finish off quickly because it'll probably be done... It'll be done, like, literally in the next couple of hours and then we'll throw those in for some work afterwards, I think. I think that's what I'm going to do there. Just get those completely finished. Um... Oh boy, um, red zone, I guess. But again, I think I'm just going to build a set and... Ugh, really? Come on, game. I've got rubbish here. It's like... Uh, man, my picks are terrible this season. Okay, uh, I think I'm just going to do that again, though, and just build... Although... 9.4. I mean, I might as well have something, might I? Might as well get some extra ones. Like 9.7 days... It's like 9.4 days, 9.7 days to build. I might as well just build those, to be honest, because one day after the race, you know. By the time the car repair's done and that, we'll have easily got those built. We might as well have that. Um, there's nothing here that's great, so we're going to go with that and then a random component, I think. So, Or maybe the red zone. Mm. The red zone's probably going to be better because we're going to get more performance out of it than that. Yeah, I think we're going to go with the red zone. Let's do that. But yeah, that's a pretty. Let's have a look. Actually, at the. Let's have a look at the. Oh wait, no, the rear wings. There we go. Pin. Well done. Oh man, this is just a, a tro Damn, this is terrible. This is really bad for picks. Really bad. Um, yeah, I think I'm gonna build some rear wings. Screw it. Although, yeah, yeah. Let's just build a rear wing. Why not? But either way, we've not got great picks there, so, uh, you know, that's fine. So, uh, I think, as I say, I think I'm just going to let this roll, get that finished. It's almost done, and then uh, we'll throw those brakes in them for a bit of work afterwards, and uh, Lara can probably use those brakes, and uh, DeVille's going to have a nice set of brakes that are 100% reliable. So, yeah, we'll do that, and uh, that rear wing's not going to take too long to build, so uh, we'll do that, and we'll come back. 
Okay, right, so we've got a expose dilemma and we're in an expose on Wolfgang races and their awful working practices. Um, uh, I mean, we don't really, where the hell are they? I don't even really care where they are. Fifth, yeah. I mean, if that was like Hammer, maybe, but ooh, actually, um, both mechanic, no, because I think that's my mechanic relationships, if I remember rightly. So it's like, there's no way I want to damage that, especially with that nurse perk. That's going to probably get us a get us close to a victory at least going to get a second spot anyway so yeah i no way i mean taking their multiplicity down would be nice but damaging my mechanic relationships no no thank you i'm not doing that you can air out you air out dirty laundry in public no way yeah i'm not doing that so uh yeah that's 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 not going to happen there at all so uh, let's just keep going because uh we're might as well wait for that uh, rear wing to be built now Okay, so here we go. The spoiler has been built, so let's go and build another one straight away. I mean, we could put the suspension in, I guess. Um, let's go red zone. Let's go with that. And then that's not bad. Yeah, well, that's okay. You know, not great, but it's okay. Um, I'll say, I think I'll just go with that rather than uh, gambling the component. I just don't think it's worth it because you know I'm going to get that one. I seem to get that one all the time. Um, but, you know, it's totally random, so you could get something amazing, but generally not. So uh, I don't know, rate that one as good as the, um, uh, get like the epic, I think it is, or a legendary component, isn't it? I think it is. Uh, that's a really good one. But uh, this one, yeah, for the great, don't, don't overly rate it. So, yeah, we'll go with that. Let's build that spoiler. That's all good. So there we go. That's a nice spoiler. We've got the brakes uh, in and been worked on, so Lara's easily going to be able to use those and strip a bit of weight out of them. Uh, we'll leave that spoiler, I think, though. Um, hmm. Actually, we're not going to use that spoiler, are we? We're just going to ignore it, I think, and we'll build. We'll use the next one that's been built because that's going to be done in seven days. Yeah, we'll probably do that, and uh, we'll just work on the gearboxes or something in the meantime. Yeah. Okay. Let's uh, get on because there's only a couple of days till uh, Singapore. So let's uh, just quickly get over there. Okay, so here we go. We're ready now to go to Singapore, but I've just had this come in a few days ago, and it's is Lara okay? And she's feeling blue down minus 30 morale for 12 weeks. Really? Come on. How's she feeling blue for? She's doing really well. She's kind of... Yeah, well, whatever. <sighs> that That's less than encouraging, but there you go. Um, you know, just another spanner thrown into the works. Oh, we got some sponsors as well. Let's come over here. Ah, we've lost our one sponsor. Okay. Um, ooh. Uh, I think we're going to go with that one. 10 races. Damn, I don't know really like that. But 800k for 5th or above. That one's good. You do get a million. But I've got to go for 4th. So I think this 5th or above is probably going to be more our speed. 8th or above, that's not great. So let's go with that one. And uh, we should be able to get a, quite a bit of uh, cash off that. So that's good. 10 races, don't overly like that, locks us in, because, uh, you know, because uh, we're going to get rid of Lara, and, uh, you know, we'll put in and hopefully get get four-star marketability, that's uh, kind of the goal uh, for next season. Um, so, uh, yeah, let's just uh, quickly get over here now, we're going to select that one as our sponsor, we're going to go and fit these few parts that we've got, uh, I've got these brakes, uh, so Lara can have that one, and Deville can have that one, do you want to have that one, and then, yeah, you'll be happy, there we go, weirdos, but there you go. Um, yeah, so she will get a boost actually on the softs and stuff, so that's not necessarily a bad thing. Uh, we'll leave those spoilers because I just don't think it's worth it, you know, compared to Lara's spoiler. Yeah, yeah, I mean, I think Lara could probably use that, but I don't think it's worth it. So that's all good. Right, we're looking at high wear, we're looking at very high fuel burn, 30 laps, and it's going to be, ooh, okay. Well, it's going to be wet in the qualifying, I can pretty much guarantee that. Well, watch it now not be wet, but there you go. Practice and rain, uh, practice and uh, race, sorry, rain, race um, are wet. So I can guarantee at least one of those qualifying sessions is going to be wet, if not all of them. But at least one of them is going to be, it's got to be a guarantee. Um, so I think we're probably going to aim for some kind of a wet weather setup, try and go into or something, I think. But uh, anyway, I shall now go off and uh, go and do some practicing and I'll see you all back for Q1. Uh, welcome to Q1 here in Singapore where it's dry at the moment, but it is probably, it's not supposed to rain, but I'm going to guess it's going to rain. Uh, maybe it's not. Yeah, maybe it's not. Uh, fair enough. Okay. Uh, I went with the intermediates because, uh, you know, the race is going to look like it's pretty going to be wet. So I think we'll go with that because 
Uh, I don't know if it's actually going to rain the qualifying. I'm pretty sure it is going to rain, but I, you know, it doesn't look like it's going to rain in this session anyway. And so, do, 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 do we go light footed? Or do we go with the inters? Hmm. Kind of want to go light footed because if we do get to Q3 and it doesn't rain, we can have a slightly better tyre, but. Hmm. Yeah, the bonuses are not massive anyway, either way. So, yeah, we could do that. Let's do that. Although, that gives us a just a tiny little boost. It's only not much, but it's something. Yeah, we're going to go with that and just kind of pretend that it's not going to rain. But I have no idea whether it's going to rain or not. But I feel like it's going to. Right, let's go there. We'll strip another bit out of that. We'll apply that to this car. And then we'll just kind of strip this down to that 60%. There we go. That's fine. Yeah, that was all good. I think I'm... Yeah, I think I'm just going to leave everything at that. 475, that's a really, that's really sweet. Actually, that could come down more, couldn't it? Because the red zone's tiny. Uh, that could come down a bit more as well, because the red zone is tiny. So, yeah, let's do that. That's, uh, that's looking pretty good. 550 on the performance. Damn, Lara, that's, just, that's a huge boost. And these things are not up to speed yet either. So, uh, you know, once everything gets... Uh, more reliability we're going to be able to strip a load away out of that it's going to be awesome brilliant right let's uh let's jump into it now and uh oh car setups 99 and a 98 i think there so uh, yeah, pretty decent so let's jump in it doesn't look like it's going to be wet so we'll go out and we'll i'm going to just go and bank a lap now i think i'm just going to go and put one on the board i think it's worth it let's just do it let's go and put one on the board and then it's up there, and then we can run again if we need to. Uh, even with it's a used set of tyres, we can run again. Don't know why I ever give you the sweetest spot. You never seem to use it very well, so, you know. Great, we've got, like, Kuchevik or someone out on track uh, getting in our way, but never mind. It is what it is. Although, actually, are they going to get in our way? Yeah, probably not. They're way too quick. Uh, DeVille has set the middle se quickest middle sector. Damn. Okay. So she's far down, Lara. Did you get slowed down by Kuchevik? No, okay, it's Balcazar. Oh, no wonder we got slowed down then. If it's Balcazar then, yeah, no wonder. <laughs> she's not doing very well at all. Damn, we are dropping down the order here. We are not doing well. Oh, boy. Okay. Damn. Oof, I don't really don't want to start down here. Um, well, at least want to have a crack at the sponsor target, but... Um, oof. Okay, well, we've got to go... Uh, I'm kind of tempted to just go out on the use set, and then we've got tyres for the race, because we know it's going to rain, but we don't know when. We might be, you know, small short stint at the start or the end or something where we could put the super soft on so we want a couple of sets i think we'll put another set on let's go with another set We've got two sets then so we know there's rain coming you know is it going to start with the with the race when it's raining we don't know you know is it going to rain in the last five laps we just don't know so i think uh, you know we'll just treat it as it's going to rain but uh, we definitely want to uh try and get some uh try and do better than what we're doing because 18th and 20th damn that's bad I just like to. Rem I should have actually just removed qualifying altogether because we're terrible at it. So, yeah. Uh, well, we got green sectors, so that's something. Um, you know that that is a bonus. We have got green sectors, so you know, good there. Deville, she's got form ten as well. Ninth, that's more like it. And tenth. Oh, ninth. Okay. Wow, look at that. A thousandth. Damn, Laura. What's up with you? Is it that morale? Is it really bumming you out, is it? That's not really going to help me uh, win this season, but uh, there you go. Well, we got through to that qualifying session anyway, so that's good. Still no rain as well. And uh, welcome to Q2, where, yep, I called it, it's raining. Okay, so we kind of want to get through to Q... I kind of wish I'd gone with that boost now. Um, what's it going to do? Yeah, it's going to rain, but then it's going to drop off. And, oof, it's going to be... Uh, yeah, it's probably going to be wet for the whole session, I think. Okay, right, we're going to go out, and we're going to do a lap, and then, yeah, we kind of want to get through this session, because it looks like tire, you're going to have free tyre choice, so we kind of want that. We kind of want to get through this session if we can. 
But again, we don't want to use too many sets of uh, inters because, yeah, we're going to need them. Um, oh, perfect, perfect. Now uh, when the track's soaking wet and it's kind of more full wet. But yeah, that's that's not a good idea, Kuchovic, because uh, it's not going to be full wets when you get round. So go Lara. No, DeVille is just doing really well. She's on fire. That form is just, just phenomenal. I can't believe how well she's doing on that. Damn. Lara's gone fastest lap just, but then uh, DeVille's just pipped her at the post at the end there. Okay, not bad. Well, Kuchovic is not going to do well, and those Balak, they're on the wet tyres, so they're not going to do very well. Yeah, it's going to rain again. Okay, I think we probably just want to jump straight out there again before that weather that hits. And try and get another lap in. I think that's what we're going to do going to go with a fresh set of tyres because this time it's free tyre choice and so we do really want to get through. I think two sets hopefully of Inters will make it work. Ah, that's probably not a good idea that I just sent them out together but still. Hopefully uh, Lara doesn't slow DeVille down too much but either way we want to we want to get out there and do that before this weather really gets bad. Um, so they're both green sectors, so that's good. Damn, we're a second off the pace. Balcazar, damn. Maybe they give it a good car this seat, this race. Um, but if we can get through, then that's free tyre choice. It's, you know, it might be raining at the start of the race. Who knows? Oh, there we go. Oh, DeVille did not manage to do it. Oh, dear. Is that, oh, wow. We did. Uh, I mean, if we can get that, that would be nice. Um, so, that was that Lara slowing you up? I can't think so, because Lara was so much quicker. So... Yeah, I just think you had a terrible run on that one. Oh, well. It is what it is, but that's free tyre choice. So, um, you know, it's probably going to be raining at the start of this race. But still, you know, um, if it's not, we've got a, we've got free tyre choice to uh, make a decision and put supers on or something. So that, that's good. I'm okay with that. Shame DeVille didn't get through, but uh, oh, well. That's, that's the way it goes sometimes. I don't think Lara held her up, though. So don't really know what happened there. And welcome to the final shootout in Singapore, where we're in Q3, and it's dry. It's not going to remain dry, though. Oh, boy. Um, oof. <laughs> I'm kind of tempted to just sit here, and we'll do one run at the end. <laughs> it's going to be kind of full wet by the time you've gone out there, done it. Yeah, I'm temp I'm going to sit here. I'm going to risk it. I'm going to keep an eye on the weather. If it's not that, we're going to, you know, we'll change it up and we'll go out. But I really don't want to uh, use another set of inters because I've used three sets already and we need some for the race. So, yeah, people have gone out on supers and, yeah, all kinds of crazy stuff. So, yeah, not good at the moment for those guys. But, yeah, it's going to be it's going to be dry till the end. So, yeah, I don't think any point of going out there. And doing anything like that is not worth it. Let's get ready. And we're going to go. Yeah, it's still dry. That's fine. We're going to go again. We're going to put a set of supers on. And we're going to go for it. I mean, to be honest, we could probably go on with a set of uh, used supers, actually. Because we'd have uh, just annihilate whatever these times are. But still. So I'm not sure if anyone's actually going to go out. Oh, hang on. Not sure that anyone. Yeah, Tomans is out. Yeah, okay. There's a bunch of us out. I kind of want. If we're in this position, I kind of want this 400k. So. Um, you know, let's go with it. I don't think we're uh, going to get there, but okay. How well are we doing? Second, not bad. Damn, that's a good one, Lara. It's only Lahane, but I don't think he's going to uh, threaten us too much. So yeah, Balcazar. Oh, Kuchovic didn't. I don't know where Kuchovic went, but uh, yeah, they. I didn't notice that. Did they go out in Q1 or Q2? Either way, they're not starting at the front, so that's good. And welcome to Singapore here on race day, and it's supposed to rain, right? When's it when's it gonna rain? Um Okay, yeah, not till lap fifteen and then it may drop off again. It might be a really just short burst of rain. Who knows? Uh we can't tell past twenty-two. So we want to get to around lap fifteen. Interesting. Okay, uh well you're gonna go race trim and nurse, and then hmm. 
I think we're probably going to go with that into tyre. Let's check out the tyres. We've got free tyre choice. Lara's got free tyre choice as well, which is awesome. I think we're probably just going to go with the mediums. Try and do a full stint. And um, yeah, and then just come in, put that inters on and maybe go to the end. Or we might have to come back in again. It, I really don't know. But uh, until the uh, race unfolds, so we get to lap eight and then we can see the whole thing. We can only see three quarters. It looks like it's going to drop off, but... Uh, it may continue to rain, it may peak up again, it may even go full wet, who knows, but I think we're going to go mediums, I think we're going to go mediums with it, and you're going to do the same also, and go a medium tyre, it's like that's, that soft would get us there, but um, it's, yeah, I don't think we got it, I think we've got to go with a medium tyre, let's go medium tyre with both drivers, uh, we're going to go attack, and we're going to go overtake, uh, so Lara is sitting in a good spot. She is in the uh, second spot. She's got free choice of tyres. And uh, to be honest, Deville's not in a bad spot either at 11th. That's not too bad either. So yeah, let's jump in and let's see how we do. I suspect... Okay, everyone's gone soft. I feel like that's probably a wrong call. Softs or supers. They're probably going to have to come in around lap 10. And either put on those... Uh... Oh, look at that. Wow. Okay, Lara. Damn. Go Lara. Well, that's that gearbox probably working out for us. Uh, where did Kuch uh, Kuchovic's down here? But um, I think they're probably going to cut their way through the field pretty quickly. Whereas, uh, yeah, go Lara. I think we're just going to keep this going for the moment. Um, I just, I really want to get as far as we can into sort of lap 15 is where we're going to bring it in. So that's kind of why I went with the mediums. I don't think the softs are going to get you there. You're going to probably have to come in a lap 12 or something. And so I feel that's why, I've, that's why I've gone with the medium. I think it's the better choice. And we could do a bit of extra pushing. Going to leave the car on the attack and overtake for a couple of laps. Uh, Deville's kind of getting stuck in the back of the field here. Um, but I think she'll be okay. Uh, Lara's able to pull away. Kuchvik and Balcazar are not doing well. That is brilliant. That is sweet, actually. I love that. That is lovely. Okay, right. How are you doing down here? Yeah, you're doing okay. Yeah, it looks like the wet weather is just going to be for a brief period, actually. doesn't look like it's going to last. <clears throat> I think we'll keep this going for one more lap, and then we're going to back off of it, because uh, I was worried about the tyres more than anything. But, uh, yeah, Lara is 24-4. That is a really sweet lap. Damn, that is a good lap. Lara, go, go, go. Okay, right. Let's drop it down now. I think we're going to drop it off. And then Deville as well. Hit a bit of a boost with you down this start. Finish straight. And just see if we can get past the number nine. There we go. And then we're going to back right off now. I think the tyres should cool off slightly. Uh, it's only, was it, 23 degrees? Yeah, they might start cooling down. Uh, we'll just hit it conserve for just a touch. Just bring those down a bit. We don't want to chew through the tyres. Uh, same here. Lara's got plenty of room. Yeah, these guys are going to come in. Um, Kuchvik and Balkas are also no Kuchvik went soft, so Kuchvik has got really good smoothness. So you might be able to get to uh, might be able to get to the end on that one. <clears throat> Up front though, yeah, we're doing all right. But these guys are going to come in. They're going to come in on like lap ten ish, and then they're either going to have to go inters or they're going to do a really short stint and stop again. They're going to double. They're going to stop extra. Yeah, looks like it's going to dry off, so we're going to come in. We're only going to be like, you know, seven or eight laps on that inter, and then we're going to come straight in, so I'm not too worried. I think we're going to go there. Let's go back to there. Deville is kind of losing out a little bit on this one. Uh, we're going to hit some hybrid mode and just start saving some fuel, I think, um, just so we don't have to put it in. Kujovic and Balcazar are not doing well, so this is this is good for us. This is good. It's like Lara's kind of lost some spots, but I'm not too worried. I am not too worried at the moment about that. Um, I think we want to... Let's go uh, overtake. Let's kind of turn the engines back up again. Temperatures are going to get a little bit crispy once we go back to this uh, neutral, so I'll probably back it up a bit. But again, a lot of these people are going to come in, so I'm not too worried. If they overtake me, they overtake me. You know, that's fine. Uh, my main concern is Deville. She's not doing great down here. Yep, they're coming in. Balcazar is coming in already. Uh, they're probably going to do two stops. I'm assuming they're going to go on to the supers, but they might not have many supers left, actually. And they might have to do... Uh, you've got 
form 10 is there some reason why you've got form 10 or you just you just do feel like you're doing really well i guess you feel like you're doing really well didn't know if she got a trait or something yeah so we're about halfway through uh we're gonna switch that off now and uh we'll let you get yours back up again yeah there's a bunch of people gonna start pitting soon so i'm not too worried uh tumans is on a good one they're probably gonna have to come in soon but um they might just be able to make those uh, softs work um, but we'll we'll start pushing when we get we get a few laps away we'll start pushing uh, we're probably gonna have to bring someone in a lap earlier as well so we'll keep an eye on that uh, there's not enough of a gap although to, ooh, okay no forget that we are gonna stay on that inter for the entire thing yeah we're gonna try and get 15 laps on that inter oh boy that's uh, gonna be tough we're gonna try it though we're gonna try it and try and get 15 laps on that and just do one stop um i think that's going to be tough but i think with a bit of tire management we can probably do it yeah people are coming in now a couple more are going to start coming in soon uh we're okay though for the moment uh deville is starting to make her way up through the field now uh, we'll get a bit of con just a touch of conserving for like uh, half a lap or something maybe a full lap and then yeah we're gonna have to stagger the pit stops because um the Ville is going to be right on top of Lara otherwise, and there's not enough of a gap to uh, separate the two of them out. Okay, right. Mm, yeah, we're going to have to do something about that, because the rain is coming back at the end. So there's just a little dip in the middle, and then it's going to come back. So I think you're probably better off just staying out on those inters. Uh, we'll just conserve them, back them up, and just really just try and, just try and get to the end on those tyres, I think. So I think with that in mind, we're going to hybrid mode try and save as much fuel Tomans is probably going to come in next lap I would say and then it's yeah people have come in and got Balcazar people are going to come in and get supers and all sorts of things on Kuchevic Inters is just way too early but to be honest you kind of got no if you're coming in the pits now you're going to have to put those Inters on it's just too close so this might work out for us we may even get and that's and may even do another pit stop on the Inters towards the end we might have enough time to do that okay I've, uh, kind of saved some weight let's go for it now so i think we're going to start pushing do a couple of laps of push and the rain is going to start probably next lap yeah a lot of people have gone onto the inters so yeah they're going to be really struggling on those inters really struggling and they're going to have to do another stop yeah we're going to go around and do one more lap I think um, ooh do we bring DeVille in now I think it's a bit too early for her but I think we've got to do it we're going to double stack otherwise there's only five and a half seconds between it like i think if we do another lap after this it's gonna be just too close she's gonna get into that um really wet spot so i think we've got to bring deville in now i don't really want to do that but i think we've got to go for it uh we're gonna put we, we're not gonna put that much fuel in we're gonna put enough fuel to get to the end now uh fast tire choice yeah she's not gonna get to the end on that one Let's put the fuel in and we're going to uh, hybrid mode and just save it as much as we can. Um, but yeah, she's she's not going to get round. She's probably going to have to do a quick cheeky pit stop at the end. But we'll, we'll try and get her to the end, but I don't think she can do it. Right, there we go. Let's let's let him go. Let's uh, let uh, her go. And then we'll get Lara to just go for it again. Tires are on. Fuel's going in. Out we go. Tenth. Deville has stopped, but she is first of the uh, wet tyres to come in. Hey, maybe Lara could do another one? Hmm. I think we might be okay, actually. Although, yeah, I think we're coming in. I think we're coming in. We're going to do that. We get. It's going to probably change partway around the lap. So, I think we're going to go... Oop, no, we actually want some fuel in there. There we go. Yeah, there we go. We'll get a, just a cheeky bit of extra fuel, and then we'll try and so it's going to be tight again. I think Lara's probably going to have to just drop in. But I think most people, to be honest, 
are going to uh, do a little pit stop anyway, so... Uh, I think a lot of people are going to have to two-stop it anyway, so I'm not too worried about that. Lara, I think most people are going to come in. Yep, Deville is now second. Perfect. Oh, that's sweet. Lara's out. She's got a nice gap. There we go. We're going to let Deville push, and then we're going to drop that tyre down now. Going to hit some hybrid mode. Going to hit the hybrid mode there as well. Although Lara's just got such a gap, such a lead now, I don't think we need to worry too much. Yeah, we're just going to drop. Uh, just going to drop Lara down. She can just. Uh, she don't need to go for it now. And um, we're going to drop you down as well. You'll do a bit of hybrid mode. Just save up some fuel, and then we'll burn it at the end if we need to. Ten on the form. I want. I don't remember she having a uh, dilemma or anything that gave a ten on form, but maybe she did. I, I don't remember. Uh, wet weather pro though. Oh yeah, that's coming into its own, of course. Oh yeah, it's wet, so she's getting plus two to everything. So I don't think she's going to catch Lara though. Lara's just got such a good car, and I mean Lara is the better driver as well. So uh, you know there is that, there is that as well. I think uh, I think she's got to conserve, to be honest. Uh, do you know what? We're going to back up for a bit. <clears throat> And I think, to be honest, I think Lara's going to do it. I'm going to try and just not stop again. We've got the fuel. It's whether we've got the tyre to do that. Um, I don't think we can do it. But I think we've got such a such an advantage here. I think pretty well much everyone. Balcazar might not stop again. But they've already stopped twice. I think there's some people aren't going to stop again. But Lara's so far ahead. She could probably stop. Get out around where Balcazar is. And then just nail it for the last few laps. And just fly and be pretty good with it I think so there we go yeah we're just going to try and get these tyres around now but uh, at this stage I don't think we need to worry too much we've got plenty of fuel uh, we can always hybrid mode if we need to got 12 laps we've got 13 laps of fuel so we've got plenty of fuel we'll just keep this going around we'll keep an eye on Lara okay yeah she has lost form now Lara's just doing her own thing. I don't think we need to worry too much about Lara at all. We'll just, uh, you know, keep an eye on her. But uh, for the most part, I think she's fine. Deville is doing good. The lap time's like 26.7, 26.3, 25.6, 24, 25.4, sorry. But they're probably, yeah, they're conserving fuel. So they are going to back up. And at the moment, Hammer Kuchevic is going to have to come in again. Look at that tyre. I think Balcazar can do it, though. Balcazar could potentially do it, but I think most people are going to stop, in which case we will do a courtesy pit stop. And uh, all this conserving might be for nothing, but um, I want to do it as if we are uh, going to stop again and, you know, go from there. Yeah, 27-1, 27-8, yeah, they've backed off behind. We're just putting in consistent 26s, so uh, yeah, we're doing all right. This is where the weather is going to drop out. You're going to be all right for a couple of laps on a soft tyre, but uh, or for like one lap maybe on the super soft, but it ain't worth it. I think we just got to stay out here, and then you know, right at the end, you'd be probably good on a full wet tyre, but again, it's only going to be a lap or two. So yeah, people are coming in already, making their final stops. Lara is catching someone to lap. Damn. Yeah, 26.8, 26.6. Yeah, we're just putting in consistent times. That's perfect. Um, let's just kind of... We'll do some conserving. Try and gain some fuel up. And then we might try and go for a faster lap. I mean, if people pit, we're definitely going to put a fresh set of tyres on. Try and get a fastest lap. I think that's the way to go. Because Lara's 10 seconds ahead. So, you know, she could get... You know, she couldn't get in and out with a set of tyres. But... Uh, because you should be pretty close. Uh, Kuchvik has stopped again. I'll say, I think Balcazar's going to try and do what we do. And he's going to try and go to the end. So we've got to, you know, we've got to keep an eye on that. But, yeah, I think we're doing all right. Tormans is going to come in again. Uh, they pitted a bit earlier than us as well. They're going to pit, so... Uh, they did 12 laps on that soft tyre. Deville did 13 and uh, Laura did 14. So, yeah... Uh, they've only managed 10 laps on that uh, Inter. Interesting. So, yeah, I think if a lot of people pit, I think we will do a courtesy pit stop and just 
um, you know, we'll put that, uh, we'll put a fresh set of boots on and see if we can get a fastest lap or something. But to be honest, I don't think you're going to get a fastest lap with the, uh, with the, with the dry start. Uh, someone will have set a time on a super softs or something and okay, I'll shut up. <laughs> what do I know? I'm just saying that and someone nails a fastest lap. Okay. I'd have thought on the dry course, I'd have thought somebody would have done a fast time that you was just no way you could beat. But okay, what do I know? Oh crap! Yeah, let's switch that off because we've saved way too much fuel. Okay, apart from you, everybody's in the pits. Uh, what gearbox? Yeah, don't worry about it. You're fine. I think what we're going to do is we're going to turn it up. Both cars are going to go, and then we're going to put a pit stop in. I think. I'm pretty sure you're going to stop, and I think we can overtake you anyway, so I'm going to try and go for the fastest lap. Yeah, we've got tons of... All we need to do is swap the tyres out with both drivers, which I think we're going to go with that. And both cars are going to come in, put a fresh set of tyres on. Yeah, you've got plenty of fuel as well. Let's go. Let's do it. I think we can probably uh, safely do that, and then we can try and get a fastest lap if we can. Come on, tyres are on. There we go. She's going to come out in first, no problem. DeVille's probably going to lose a play. No, he, they've come in as well. Perfect. There we go then. Let's go. Let's burn some of this fuel off. See if we can get a fast lap before the, uh, before the wet weather comes in. No, don't do that now because we just did a pit stop, didn't we? So, uh, yeah, we try, try and go this lap if we can. See if we can get a faster slap, but I don't think we're going to do it. But we may as well try. Um, we've got uh, we've got the uh, tyres and everything to do it. So let's just go. But yeah, the, it's really getting too wet now. So yeah, I don't think it's going to work. But it was worth a shot. Yeah, tire deg's gone through the roof. No, she did a personal best, but yeah, no, it's it's not happening. Let's just back off and we'll, we'll just back off now. There's only three laps to go. That's a shame, but still a 1-2 again. That's going to be perfect. You know, we've just got to keep it on the track now and uh, bring it home. Uh, we won't stress anything too much. We'll just bring it home. We're going to have a bit of extra fuel on board, but yeah, that's fine. Not too worried about that. Oh, Rodriguez had mechanical issues. Damn. And Balcazar and Kuchevic are still outside the points, so this is brilliant. This is working out really well. If they can stay outside the points, but uh, Sevilla is going to just... Uh, oh, Balcazar is coming up. They're going to snatch a cheeky point, I think. They are going to snatch a cheeky little point there, I think. Damn it. And yeah, it's like really soaked now. It's uh, kind of full wet territory, but... Uh, it, it ain't worth it, you know, not for one lap. It's really not worth it. So yeah, let's just uh, let's just do this. Uh, might as well burn extra fuel, why not? You know, I'm not I'm not gonna push the cut I'm not gonna push tell them to push it though, because uh, I don't want them spinning off on the last lap, so you know. Let's uh, let's just leave it at that. Uh, yeah, Kuchevic, Balcazar, come on, hold on, Sevilla, hold on. You've got enough tyre to make it. You can hold off. Yeah, Tomans is coming up the rear now. He's just, oh, God, can we hold it off? Yeah, I think Balcazar. There we go. Lara's over. Yes, Deville's over. Perfect. And does Balcazar get in a thing? Let's watch. Yes. Hammer didn't score anything. Uh, we didn't get a pole and we didn't get uh, fastest lap, but we just walked away with 16 points. So and they walked away with nothing. So yeah, that was a good one. Well done, Lara. Perfect dominant performance. Rain really helps out there. That's a good one. That's a step towards victory. And there we go. There we are. Uh, who got fastest lap? Uh, pole position was Tomans and oh right, right down here. Okay, so. Hammer, yeah, because Kuchu, I'm not sure actually when Kuchovic dropped out, but uh, I'll have to watch it back when I edit it. But um, yeah, um, they did not score poles. They didn't score any points, 
brilliant. That's so nice. So that's really going to help her out in the championship as well. Double podium. Nice kind of plain boring trophy, but still it's fine. There we are. She's just jumped over Kupovic now. Four points adrift at the top. It's really good. And to be honest, um, DeVille's catching up as well. I mean, you know, if we get, act, get her to act as a rear gunner, that's just going to be brilliant. I mean, to be honest, either one could win it. Who knows? I mean, remember what happened to Shen. So, uh, you know, Lara's not actually won a championship yet, has she? So, yeah. And there we go. 38 points clear at the top now. Oh, that's looking that's looking tasty now. That is looking really tasty. Um, yeah, six rounds still to go, but that was a solid result. We needed that. We need a couple more like that to uh, really do it. And a couple of fastest laps and pole positions to... Really try and secure that driver's championship is really what we need now. Right, so here we go. We're just waiting for those stat gains to drop in. Here we go. There we are. Oh, wow. Look at that. She's maxed out overtaken already. Damn. Oh, my God. Damn. She's doing well. She is flying up there. Look at that. Look at that. She's like three and a half stars already. Oof. That is so good. Yeah, they'd make a pretty good team next season, actually. Not bad at all. Pretty pleased with her. And, uh, you know, you never know. There might be a good reserve driver that we could uh, get as well. We'll see. Um, first, and, yeah, of course, the chairman's all happy. We did hit both sides of that sponsor, actually, didn't we? So, yeah, that's reduced our money loss. Only 737. That's good. Right, well, there we are. That was a really good comeback drive. We kind of needed that. First uh, first race was good, and then we had a couple of weak races uh, in the middle there. The first two or three were pretty weak. And then, uh, yeah, we've been uh, showing some pretty good pace uh, since then. Uh, we've been able to do a lot of weight stripping, though, and the new parts are coming online. And really, Lara with that uh, weight stripping uh, really helps her out most of the time. Um, and she's a fantastic driver anyway. Her smoothness especially is really good. And Davila, to be her credit, she's got really good smoothness as well. So, uh, you know, they're really good on the tyres. Um, only four points ahead of Kucevic. So, uh, you know, it's not looking great there still. It's still a battle. Um, but uh, we've got Deville. She's bringing up the rear. And, uh, you know, she's going to act as a rear gunner for Lara. But uh, as I say, you never know. Uh, Lara never actually won a championship. Uh, Shen won it. So... You know, it's all to play for. It's double points at the end on the last race as well. So, uh, you know, it's all to play for. But the team championship is looking pretty tasty at the moment. I think we're probably, you know, we're not quite wrapped that up yet, of course. Nowhere near, to be honest. We've got six races to go. But it's looking good. It's looking good at the moment. So, uh, yeah, I think this is where I'm going to call it and end the episode. So if you like that one, please give me a thumbs up. Comment with your thoughts down below. Subscribe for more. I really do appreciate it. Stay safe out there, everyone. And I'll catch you next time.